Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how we can submit the form in Laravel. So let's get started. So first of all, we need a form. So just create a form here and change the URL word whatever you want. Like uh, okay, so a URL should be URL scope resolution and two to give a hyphen or whatever just after the base URL. So that's fine. The method is post and now give a uh, give a field name which is the input you can put the name name and just check one more button it should be submit click me all right so let's check the form so this is a uh, this is the form here and now go to uh, the web.php so the web.php we can so i'm going to delete for now this code and just make a route here i just delete the code so that we can make it from the very scratch and post here post because we are uh, accepting the request in the post method and now this is the our the controller name so our controller name is user at the rate show all right so so this is my method controller this is my controller and if you know if you don't know how to make the controller you can just uh, your previous video here i just explained the about the controller uh, and so if you don't want to go for the last video so you can see that just go to your http uh, go to the app folder with the http and just click on the controller and here you you can create your new controller i just created a controller the user controller name so just pass a method name like request Oops. Oops. what's going on keyword request and put a variable name like whatever you want this is request all right so now for we can just see is it working or not for now uh, it should be sh uh, written the submit function all right let's check if everything is fine no there should be some issue i think yeah i forgot to put the semicolon here and one more thing guys but uh, that we have to put actually i just remember that so uh, without that uh, we are not able to pass the token and without the token the laravel did not submit the forms so just go to your template and inside the form just shoot two curly brackets with the csrf underscore fill pass it like a function all right so now let's send anything whatever you want like hello so this is a show function and just see if i'm not uh, passing the token here go to the back so you can see that the page has expired due to inactivity because the, uh, this is no, uh, this is a security token and laravel don't work without the security tokens all right guys so now what we feel here and how we can see that 
to see the adjust we can print out for now and write here request input and just pass the name here just write uh, the name like sam oops yeah sam show functions show function is showing because i uh, i can remove this for now i think it will work yeah so if you have more than one field then you can just uh, if you want to show the all uh, all post requests then just remove the parameters of input function and just refresh this. so you can see that this is our token with the name sam and button is a blank for now so this is the simplest way to send the method from view and you can access it in the router or in the controller so thanks guys thanks for watching this video and if you have any query related to laravel you can put me in the comment give a thumbs up on the video and don't forget to subscribe our channel for more videos thanks guys thanks for watching this video